at the Ruma National Park in Kenya, researchers have been closely tracking the wild population of rhinos. So here we are seeing more of a woody part, we are seeing sort of a branching part of a, maybe a cache or something like that. But despite close observations, Kenya's rhino population is facing a new threat, drug-resistant bacteria. A team of scientists have discovered alarming levels of antibiotic resistance in faecal samples taken from 16 black rhinos. It's feared these protected creatures have become the unintended casualties of the rampant overuse of antibiotics. Typically, resistance develops when drugs are used to treat non-bacterial infections or when the full course of medication is not completed, allowing bacteria to recover and adapt. Farmers in the country have also been overusing the medication to treat livestock. With rhino population numbers already dwindling from poaching, it's feared this latest development will make it harder to treat common bacterial infections, such as bovine tuberculosis. When animals are endangered, they are highly monitored like human beings. They cannot be allowed to be sick. And if they are sick, they need to be treated. It's still unclear exactly how the rhinos have developed resistance, but it could be through drinking water running through the national park, among other causes. We could be transferring these resistant genes to them and microbial resistant genes to them because uh, it, human beings harbors a lot of antimicrobial resistance due to our interaction with antibiotics. There are roughly 29,000 wild rhinos remaining worldwide, with 5% of that number living in Kenya. This latest threat is just one more battle facing the already critically endangered species. Rachel Merritt, ABC News.